What's happening? Thanks for coming to Hubbard's journey, checking out our journey. Occasionally you'll see a sighting in our videos. That's my, my wife, she's always in the background. Haven't shaved in a couple of days, irritates the hell out of me. But it's, I'm lazy. You can see I'm here in sunny Florida, Clearwater, Florida, sitting by the pool. And it looks good, but we haven't been in the pool because it's just too much work to get in the pool. But I appreciate you looking at this video. This video here is Amber Cove. Now, I've been to Amber Cove maybe five, six times on a cruise ship. And um, I usually get off the boat, stay at the port area. I head up to this, this uh, mountainside there. It's a little hill, not a mountain, a little hill. And it's got a great view of the ship. And it's got a great view of the... Um, pool area you can see different stuff and I usually have a couple beers up there and that's basically all I do I never really left the port area on this particular journey I was with my daughter her wife and her two kids uh, my granddaughter and grandson and um, my sighting and uh, they wanted to do an excursion at Ocean World oh my god if you have a family or if you're into dolphins, uh, sea lions, and birds, and sharks, and stuff like that, it's definitely worthwhile doing this uh, excursion. And you'll see that in the video that I'm going to play after my intro here. Um, but uh, I can't say enough about it. The only thing is what we notice is when, we, when they booked the excursion, they weren't taking into consideration time. So what happened when we got there, we looked at the time we got there, the time we had to leave, the ship had to leave, uh, and the time we had to finish. And it was only like maybe four hours. So I would uh, recommend looking at the times. How much time do you want? How much time do you need? I mean, we squeezed, we literally squeezed everything in, in four hours. Um, was it hectic? No. Um, we just like going at a, long, a, a better pace, I guess. And maybe the pace would add another half an hour or 45 minutes. So if we had an extra half an hour, 45 minutes, it would have been a little bit easier for us. Don't, don't get me wrong. It was still easy. Mentally, it was probably more of a problem thinking, oh, we're only here four hours. What the hell? How much did we pay for this excursion? That kind of stuff goes on in our heads. But in reality, maybe an extra half hour, 45 minutes made it, made it a little bit less stressful. I say less stressful, it really was It was stressful when we first got there. Oh my God, do we have enough time? Is this gonna happen? Can we see everything? Once we started getting acclimated with the, the shows and how everything was flowing, and it worked out, it worked out. But the stress factor was at the beginning when we recognized uh, how much time that um, we had to get back to the boat how much time we were there. You hear that annoying noise in the background? That right there is my uh, pool filter pump and I need to get that taken care of or at least shut the friggin' thing off when I'm doing videos like this, right? Um, so Amber Cove, Ocean World, um, Dolphin Show was amazing. You get tons of images of dolphins, videos of dolphins. Uh, the sea lion show was amazing. The unfortunate thing is I have to cut out all the music and the music was amazing as these uh, fish, uh, I say fish, dolphins, which is a mammal, I believe, um, are doing their show. So I'm gonna have to add different types of music in there that's not copyrighted. Oh, what a pain in the ass that is. Uh, constantly, because I like doing live stuff and when I do live stuff, I'm just capturing the moment. And unfortunately, a lot of the music that happens to me in my live stuff is copyrighted. Um, so I gotta deal with that. Um, let me see, I do a lot of ums, ums, cause I'm trying to think of other things in the video. So we, in the video, or excuse me, in the movie I'm gonna show you after this is entering Amber Cove. Um, my daughter, my, uh, granddaughter we're at the breakfast table and i'm trying to mimic a dolphin because we're going to a dolphin show so my impersonation of a dolphin dolphin is <laughs> you'll see that 
at the dinner table, or excuse me, at the breakfast table. So I was trying to mimic a, a dolphin to get her all jacked up and ready for the ocean world. Um, with all that said, I'm gonna start showing you the video that I clipped together. Um, I really appreciate you guys watching, everybody who's watching. If you like it, I guess this is what you're supposed to say. I mean, I see it on every single video. If you like it, subscribe here. If you, uh, no, if you like it, yes, come subscribe here. If you like the video, like here, you know the routine. Uh, I don't think they say you know the routine, but that's what I'm saying because every freaking video you look at YouTube, subscribe here, like here, please. I'm begging you. No, I'm not doing that. If you like it, snap on it. Um, obviously, my live stuff is way better than snapping stuff together, I think. Um, so when I'm done with the Amber Cove, I think what my goal is is to put together one long, because I broke it into segments. I did um, Grand Turk, Princess K. Now I'm doing Amber Cove. And then I did At Sea with the Magic uh, cruise ship. So what I'm going to do is just splice those all together and just make it one um, Magic Cruise family cruise. And um, so I have it in segments and then I have it as one big video. Um, if you have any questions or anything like that or comments, please let it, lay them out there. I'll answer freaking anything that you have to uh, ask. But I appreciate you guys watching, and let's get into this. Entering Amber Cove, Dominican Republic. This is our bus ride to uh, Ocean World. Welcome to Ocean World. They do a traditional Dominican dance when you arrive. <laughs> What's going on there, buddy? Where you going? Oh, you see there's no food over here? You see gonna take off? They're adorable. They're kissing.
This is where they have the uh, dolphin show. Everybody will sit over here uh, when the show's ready. I think it's a one o'clock time. <laughs> Look at the size of these guys. We have a sighting. There it is. Oh my god, I love her. Oh, it's like in the next. Hi, how are you? You're a sweetheart, huh? That's how they roll, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You're a troublemaker. No, 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 look. Oh, she's a troublemaker. Go, 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 go. Are you videoing? Video. Oh. Oh, I can Look at his hair. Did he get that? I probably should have said, look at his bite? feathers, yeah, right? Because he's not with the training. If you put him to make a some behavior, and you don't report him. Wow. All right, I'm ready. Go Where are we going that way? Oh, you don't. Different color, different type of them. With your camera, you take pictures, you can go beside it. If you want the bird on you, we put on you, but you have to pay extra for those type of pictures. If you have any Did you catch the comments that you would have to pay extra if they put the bird Roman, on you? I don't know what that extra yeah. is, maybe five this one bucks. Is you know, but it's always uh, it, somebody's to trying to make money. Room. Keep an Paper. eye on your money, because if you don't keep an eye on your money, Someone's gonna take it one so way or another. Yeah. Oh, he said, no thanks. You need to clap and make noise like crazy people because if you don't do it, this guy will go for you and take it out of the water. Okay? Hey. <laughs> if I were you, I would do it, guys. By the way, she's gonna die today. Huh? Oh, sorry, I mean die. Sorry, sorry. Are you ready? Perfect. So what about you find us ready? ready? All right, behind people, good afternoon. We're going to the shot time. So we are the Pirates. And here also we have an exciting adventure for You can be our brave victims. Blah for every word. Oh, sorry. Our volunteers Volunteer. are decided to fit, touch, and swim with our crew of blow 30 sharks. Yes. Now, the rest of the crew and me would like you yes. have a safe phone spell with us. Yes, last day spell. That's why we have a few suggestions yes. to help ensure that there is no guarantee. No guarantee. There is no guarantee that you with your all important appendage attached to your body. Yes. No, no. Hey, no. Thank you. Take it easy, man. Take it easy. Remember, this animal I'm about to interact with are sharks. Sure. They need to with the other spell all the time. All the time. When well, you are baiting the sharks, sure. only touch them behind the eyes. Behind the eyes. At the same time, you're going to notice how raw well the skin is. How raw well the skin is. Long time ago, the skin of these sharks sure. was just a sand paper. Sand paper. So when you're feeling the sharks, sure. we're going to give a little fish. Yeah. Hold the fish by the tail. By the tail. Bring it from the shark mouth and drop it when they shot the feet for your points on hands, you will always not be like so our so our sharks they have good eyes and have an incredible scent to smell scent to smell because they can detect just like the tiny drop of blood it's it's just so when you swim with the sharks, sure. please tell the surface, surface. never going down. Never. And the most important thing to remember is yes, to have fun and, and don't, don't get eaten. So clap your hands. <laughs> All right, because these animals are sharks, we're going to simulate using some blood, so send the blood. Send the blood. More blood. More blood. 
These blood brothers shall feel hungry and not great. Hey! What are you doing? Yeah, but I'm talking about the shark, not you, buddy. Take it easy. <laughs> All right, pilots ready? Ready! Let's do this. Hey, what was that? <laughs> oh, you could smell that oh fish, my. huh? They are kind of great today. All right, my happy people, that was our promotional part. So now, let me remind you why you have to pet the shards all the time behind the eyes. Why? Because if you put one finger in front, that's going to happen to you. All right, my happy people, in the pool we have the nurse shards. They can live 40 to 50 years and they can grow more than 14 feet. In the pool, we have four of them. Manchita, Flipper, Snoopy's, and Coffee Break, and our biggest one, Hannah. Pin bottle bottle with a small mouth, they are unable to consume large fish. They hung along and catch the prey from the sea floor, mostly by sucking the prey into the mouth. While doing this, they may be second by sucking sound like this. It's completely unique to this species, okay? So now, our victims come to interact with our shark. So please, shark number two, Omega, go over here. It's about to interact with our sharks. So please. Let's see if you survive today. One more. And one more. Okay, screw a little bit, please. And put the shark all the time behind the eyes. Feed the skin. It feels really rough, like a sand's paper right there. So now it's time to touch the sexy belly. Look at this. Touch right here. Then touch here. And can don't touch the pee, -pee and don't touch the mouth. <laughs> so now it's time to feed the sharks. All the fish. Feed the shark right here and just drop it. Okay. So please have a seat now. And I got it. Now, belly. Boy, they go after it quick, belly huh? One side and look our camera. Oh, okay, all right. So I look at the face, smiling on her. Yeah. So now, touch right here and say bye bye. After this, we are going to swim with Sean. So please have a seat. See you in a minute. All right, clap your hands for her because she is still alive. By the moment. All right, hi people, if you would like to touch the shark, feeding, and also swim with them, just like close to our guest service, they're going to give you all the information about it, okay? So this is the way how we feed our shark here at Ocean World. As you can see, nobody has been eating. Yeah. yeah. Our shark say bye-bye like this. Shark ready? Ready. Let it go and say bye-bye. Díganle, hasta la vista, baby. All right, clap your hands for our shark. Clap your hands. All right, my high people, thank you for coming. Thank you for joining us. That was our shark feeding time. Call me on next. See you on show. Point number seven on your mouth. Let's see. You look like supper to them. Fuerte el aplauso, 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 fuerte Elidio, y tenemos a Patria. Patria now has a sexy Dominican smile. Una hermosa sonrisa sexy Dominican. Así que sonríe, smile. Yeah. Así que sean todos bienvenidos. Y welcome to our super sin pa 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 pa.
Un aplauso, un aplauso. Bueno, competencia. One, two, three, go. Ready. One, two, three. Hey. Yeah. Here we go. Un aplauso. Tendremos fiesta latina y suena así. Ladies and gentlemen, Latin party and sounds like this. Let's hit the floor of this guy. It's very cool. Gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Ocean World and our show, Ocean Fun. Show 
show you the bond between our dolphins and their trainers. Although dolphins are predators, the trust and friendship allows our trainers to enter in their home and spend time with them in the water. It all becomes a game. Even you can enter in their world by participating in one of our interactive programs. If you'd like to do this, just contact one of our guest services representatives and have fun. Well, that was our trip to Amber Cove. Now we're just heading back to the port, taking some images. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Jason Andors. What a comedian. He played in the uh, Spotlight Lounge the other night, and we had lobster. Oh, my God, the lobster was unbelievable. But anyways, thanks for watching. You know the drill.